On the storm watch this morning, people in and around Houston are waiting for floodwaters to recede after enduring three days of heavy rainfall from Tropical Storm Imelda. Many residents say the flooding is worse than when Hurricane Harvey hit back in 2017. This morning, at least two people are dead. CBS 4's Laura Podesta has the latest. Longtime residents of Southeast Texas are devastated by what Imelda brought. The fact that there's cars stranded and people are getting high water rescued, that's never happened in our time that we've lived here. From Houston to Beaumont, people say the flooding is worse than when Hurricane Harvey hit two years ago. We never flooded before and, and we've had a lot worse rain than this and it's never been this bad. More than 40 inches of rain fell in 72 hours. Drivers were forced to abandon their cars. They got the things that were important, put them in backpack and just walked out. The, the water was about uh, knee high. Even this 18 wheeler couldn't handle the deluge. The driver was pulled up onto his truck by a man passing by who saw him in trouble. One man died when he drove his van into eight feet of flood water. It was a good 20 minutes before they got him out and it was just beyond, you know, he was underwater too long. Officials in Harris County say there have been more than 1,700 high water rescues and evacuations. Oh my God, I'm level off. I'm just so thankful. It was an emotional day for people like Jean LeBlanc and his 12-year-old son, Adam. Yeah, we're back to ground zero again. So. They lost almost everything when Harvey hit. I thought of losing everything in my house and restarting everything again. Houston officials canceled school today as the city begins to clean up. Laura Podesta, CBS News.